Where's the ladies who bought tickets for Not Tonight? Where are you? <laughs> On the front fucking row! <laughs> Amazing! I mean, it's a good job you're attractive because you're thick as fuck. <laughs> you lot don't know what happened, right? But they bought tickets for last week by accident and then turned up tonight. But worse than that, they weren't even tickets for a fucking Saturday, were they? <laughs> who booked them? Who are you? How did you manage to fuck up so well? It's your mum's birthday today. So you got your mum's birthday wrong as well? How long has she been your mum? Is it a new mum? Have you just got it? Did you buy it? Was it one of those, ah, oh, fucking a lockdown buys on Amazon? You bought yourself a new mum? 27 years you've been a, are you her mum, really? You do not look old enough at all. Well done. I say, well done, it's genetics, you've got nothing to do with that whatsoever. It's just that your dad and your mum have got good genes and you happen. And then the thick one came out. <laughs> so what's your name, by the way? What's your name? Emma. Emma. Are you local, Emma? Are you from round here? Yeah. Yeah? yeah? What, what do you do for a job? I'm Hang on one second. You're not Emma. <laughs> You're not sat here either. So, yeah, shut the fuck up, dickhead. <laughs> I've got this, mate. I can do a conversation all by my own. And here's our doorman who's been stuck in lockdown doing nothing but masturbate furiously. His right arm is fucking massive. This is true. <laughs> what did you say you do for a living, Emma? I'm a child therapist. A child therapist? Yeah. Is it because they won't trust you with the grown ups? Yeah. <laughs> That's a lovely job, that's a, that's a respectful job to have. And how many kids have you actually proper fucked up? I mean, ticket booking's quite a simple thing. And last time I checked, the mental health of children was quite a complex world to work in. Do you know him? So what's your name, Mum, by the way? Tracy. Tracy, and it's your birthday today. And, and how old are you today? 53! You Happy don't. Birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday. There you go, you got that just for your birthday. Just imagine, if you were here last week, you wouldn't have got that. <laughs> You'd have got in though. <laughs> do you have a job, Tracy? Yes. What is it? I work for the NHS. What do you do for the NHS? <laughs> don't start cheering, dickhead. It's not Thursday in 2020. <laughs> She thinks it is. <laughs> so what do you do for the NHS? Because usually people say, I'm a nurse or I'm a doctor. And it's like, that's an amazing job. And those people that don't do those jobs say, I work for the NHS, give me the respect. <laughs> so what is it? What is it you do? Oh God, I'm a GP receptionist. A GP receptionist? <laughs> don't fucking clap her! You see that respect go right through the non-existent window. You went there from being child-saving brain surgeon of the year to the worst thing known to man. Channel 5 have got five programmes about bailiffs and not one about NHS doctor's surgery waiting room ladies because you are the worst thing that has ever happened to the world ever. I'm sorry, but I've got 40 years of anger inside me of ringing up and saying, can I have an appointment? No, you fucking can't. <laughs> Why can't I have an appointment? How ill are you? I don't know. It's <laughs> why I need to see a fucking doctor. <laughs> well, what's wrong with you? My legs come off. <laughs> well, that's not an emergency, is it? Which doctor's surgery is it? Is it local to here? Yeah. Is, is it my doctor's? <laughs> which, which one is it? It's in Lytham. It's in Lytham. It's not my doctor's. Thank fuck for that. Because I guarantee I am not getting any more drugs other than HRT for a laugh. Oh, I hope you have a lovely birthday, even though you don't fucking deserve it. 
God, did you imagine if I turned up late, like a week and a day late for an appointment? <laughs> but I wouldn't be fucking let in, would I? <laughs> I like you guys, you're really nice, I like you. I'm gonna, gonna fuck off now before I ruin it for everyone. <laughs> You don't know what you like. You think you're outside shouting at a bin. 